Hey everyone, welcome to another video. Today it's of the NG Models United Airlines Boeing 777 200ER and the Star Alliance Library. So we'll start off the box. This video is being made at the request of somebody. You see a model in the collection that I have not reviewed and you'd like to, that you'd like to see a review, feel free to request that. So here we got the side, the other uh, CGI of the aircraft with the Star Alliance art on the box. And you got the you got the Star Alliance logo right around here. And then you got the United logo on the box. And the United Titles registration is November 770 22. NG titles there. One four in the scale collectible models, die case metal. Here's the right side, left side, top, bottom, and the back of it. Now for the model. Starting off here, we have the nose cone painted on, and the uh, cockpit window there with the Peter Tobes and the Star Alliance logo there. Don't know what that thing is over the door though. If any of you know what it is, feel free to comment. And then down here, you have the partial registration ship number. And then the, there's the L1 door. There's the uh, United Titles and you got Star Alliance written across there. Here on the engine, these are, um, hold on, not sure what engines these are, but I'll look into it. <laughs> and then you got the registration, which is November 770-22. The American flag, you got the rear door. And then you have the Star Alliance logo on the tail. And here on the right side of the model, decided to hold it instead of turning it around to take it easy on the landing gears. You pretty much got the same stuff except at the cargo luggage doors, there's one there and one back there. So we'll show the ankles of this model now. Here's the left side of it. Here's the front view. Let's get the camera to focus, there we go. Here's the right side. And here's the back view. And here's the top. Then here's the bottom. There in the front, you got the landing gear retraction doors. And then you got the other landing gear retraction doors for the buggy gears. There's a stand hole there. And on the back of the doors to the APU and then the APU itself. So that about wraps everything up for today's video. Hope you enjoyed. And I'll see you in the next one.